Okay, next up is formatting the partition. So we've uh, bought a hard disk, we've sliced it in three pieces and he knows now there are three parts on the system, but it's not formatted yet. So once the partitions have been created, each must be formatted with an appropriate file system. So file system, what's that? You have views, you have read only, you have all these kinds of uh, possibilities and sometimes people ask me the strangest uh, things that I never installed. Um, but mainly, the most of us, we used to work with X3, but today, I guess, we'll have to work well with X4. So, lots of elements, and they have all their uh, uh, disadvantages and advantages. And it's all up to the user to see how he will use it. But basically, we just need to format it in a certain way. And this is X4 as an example here, and device SDA1. But you just can't copy paste this we have to think about it and what did we make and what did we change and that's what we're doing together now there's also a link here I see that I've visited all right also so about partitioning about LVMs the logical volume manager rate stuff so rate is having four hard disks, disks and assuming that it's one make making so that it's uh, reacts as one or you can mirror, which is uh, A and B is the same. So if one breaks down, you have already the other one there. And so it uh, continues to work. Lots of possibilities, but not interesting for us. Um, we can mount stuff, we'll do that later. Do we do a mount and unmount? But let's get ahead and fix this. So what else do we need to do? We have now or set up our three pieces up there and we need to format things. We need to say, make me a file system. And then you can make a lot of things, you see, BTRFS, and Minix, uh, old thing probably from uh, Linux. Uh, but what we need is just X4. We can choose two, three and four. So let's take, um, well, sorry, actually I wanted to make the, the logical order of things is that the first one was the one of um, um, the EFI. So let's do that one first, logical orders first. So the fat one. So we are going to do this one. We're going to say, take 32, F32. And then say device SDA1. That was the first thing we did. That is our first part or slice on our hard disk. That's it. Now, if you want to know more, like I'm eager to know, so dot fat. What's this in here? So you see some information if you want to know. Um, well, I think I missed here a line or two. Yep. So I wanted to know fat, my friend. So create an MS-DOS file system under Linux. Hmm, nice. So we're working actually with MS-DOS file system. Yes, we are. And there was this uh, minus F32. Let's have a look. So the fat size specifies the type of file allocation tables used. 12, 16, or 32 bits. That's it, 32 bits. Okay, so you can always learn more by just uh, typing in man. Always a good thing to do. Now, next up is um, partition two, I guess. Partition two is the swap. So you say make swap device SDA Two. Enter. Setting up swap space, etc. You have to put it also on. So once you make the swap, you can do a swap on device SDA2. That's that. And the most important one is the one I started with. Which it is the most important one. It's going to be your root. And that's make the file system dot x4. And then you say, give me device SDA3. 
and everything looks normal this is what's supposed to happen and there we go we have now formatted everything with all these codes and voila there is some difference i guess uh, we see the word swap i don't think that was there in france so there you go we have now formatted everything and we can move on to the next